guys, it's your girl Jalinda and I'm back again today with another video. Today I took a trip to Walmart. I did a little bit of a grocery haul there and I just picked up things that we needed, some things we were low in, some things we were out of, and I also picked up a couple of non-grocery items that um, I needed for a project that I'm going to be doing very soon. So I told you about this project, so I'm going to show you what I got so far for it and also show you what I got at the grocery store. So stay tuned. And guys, excuse my bushy hair. Um, my hair got wet. It's raining outside and it got wet and this is how it dried. And so this is what I got. This is what I'm left with. So. Hey guys, here is my haul from Walmart. Um, um, just picked up, like I said, of things that we needed, some things that we were out of. Um, I got some more of the Cheetos mac and cheese. We are crazy about this stuff, guys. We love it. And this is, of course, our favorite flavor is the, I think it's jalap cheesy jalapeno. That's our favorite. So I said it was no reason to buy the other flavors if this is the one that we like the most. So I bought six boxes of that. And I also got me some of the Cran Plumagranate um, Ocean Spray cranberry juice it's really good guys you should try it if you haven't tried it it's 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 good it's been around a while i mean i've i've drink i've, I've been drinking it for years it's, it's been around a while but a lot of people said that they haven't tried it so guys give it a try it's really good um i also got me some bagels some plain bagels um got some gold medal all-purpose flour some sugar also got a loaf of um wheat bread, sandwich bread, um, some tortillas. I uh, also got some red bell pepper. If you can see what that is in the plastic, it's red bell pepper. Um, I use that in a lot of recipes. I also got some, some celery here. I use that in a lot of my recipes, a lot of the things that I cook. And I also got a bunch of bananas just for snacking and I may make a, a banana pudding soon, I'm not sure. Um, and sometimes if these go too ripe on you, you can just always make banana bread and that's always a good thing to save your bananas, uh, to not waste, waste them. Um, also got some green bell peppers, if you can see that's what that is. Uh, also got some russet potatoes. And you guys, if you hear some crashing noises, that's the um, flag wreath that I showed you the other day when I was doing my patriotic decor video, that's the noise that it makes on the back of the door. I said that it kind of bangs around and that's what it does. It's, it just bangs around on the door. It makes quite a bit of noise, but it's very cute. <laughs> okay, so we also have some cream, Campbell's Cream and Mushroom Soup. I use that in a lot of my recipes. Um, also, Got some no some um, hormel chili no beans and I also got my um, sirloin burger chunky Campbell's chunky soup and got some, some jambalaya Campbell's chunky jambalaya also got some sweet peas um, I'm the only one who eats sweet peas in the house and I don't eat them all I, I only let's put it this way I only eat them with one dish. When I make one certain dish, I eat sweet peas with that. And I don't have them any other time because I'm not a huge fan. I like them with that one dish. And I can eat them in like fried rice and you know, recipes, but I just, I'm not a big sweet pea fan. And the other people in the house will not eat them at all. So I'm doing good. At least I eat with one, eat them with one meal. Okay, also got, I like it in the four packs of the Del Monte uh, vegetables. I got corn. I just got one can of, one four pack of the corn because I have another pack in the pantry already. So I got two four packs of the cut green beans. Uh, we love green beans. So, also got some Kraft sharp cheddar, just shredded sharp, and I get mild too. Also got me some more of the Noor tomato bouillon. 
I use that in a lot of recipes that I use, I mean, that I make. Uh, also got some mesquite turkey sandwich meat. Um, got some more extra large eggs. Got some cream cheese. Got some more 2% milk. Um, also got, you can see that's canola oil. And also got some extra virgin olive oil for cooking. Um, I got us some Southern Style Biscuits brands. Those are really good for breakfast or dinner. Um, I got some whole okra. Also got some broccoli florets. Um, I got us some of the shredded steak cheese and rice chimichangas. Um, I usually get just the shredded, shredded steak and cheese. And it's good, but it, uh, this one is different. It has rice in it, so I, I wanted to try that. Also got some raw shrimp uh, peeled and de-banged with the tail on. Um, also got two packs of the honeysuckle white uh, 85 lean 15% fat um, ground turkey. And I got two of those. Um, so, yeah, we, we go through those pretty quick. You know, I make everything, everything that you would make with beef or ground beef, I use I use ground turkey instead. I got us some Uncrustables, the strawberry um, flavor. I also got some pork chops, center cut chops. I got us some ribeye steak. Uh, also got us a chuck roast. Now, those are just things that we were out of and needed and some things needed to replace. Um, yeah, so that's that's our haul from Walmart. It ran me about $200 for everything you see here. And there's not really a time that I ever go to the, to the store for groceries that I don't spend around $200, so. But that's our haul from Walmart. Now, I also wanted to show you guys the other um, non-grocery thing that I got. Um, just something that I said I needed um, because I'm going to be doing my closet soon. And I needed to get something for my closets. And I couldn't find them for the longest. I thought maybe they'd stop selling them, the plastic, these plastic hangers. This is what I've been going with in my closet. And I wanted to continue with the black hangers. I wanted to keep getting these um it took me forever to find they, they have them at walmart uh, i had uh in the past bought them at the dollar general store and they didn't have them any anymore so when i saw them at walmart i was glad to see them because i hadn't seen them where i normally buy them and they have where i normally buy these they have just literally taken these away and they've replaced them with the more fancy hanger. And, and I like those hangers, but I don't want to start over my whole hanger collection because they changed hangers. You know, so I want to keep going with the ones I've been using. And I've been going with black in my, clo in my closet. Um, and I also have another closet that I've been using um, red in. And so I wanted to continue with the red in that closet. So, yeah. So I just got several, several packs. They're packs of 10. They're in packs of 10. So I just got um, four, six. I got six, six packs. So I have 60 hangers here. Um, and I'm going to need every one of them. Trust me, guys. And I think I really need to check the receipt, but I think that they were only a little over a dollar each pack. It was only a little over a dollar. And I would have to look at the receipt to see exactly how much, but they're very inexpensive. These seem to be pretty strong. They've always worked for me, you know, and they're so inexpensive that if one breaks or something, then you just you just buy more. That's how I, I see it. But I'm not, I don't want to change my whole closet of hangers. I don't want to do that. So I'm just glad I found them. But yeah, that's what I was going to do because I'm going to be doing my closet soon. I'm going to be um, cleaning out my closets and, and kind of 
sorting out things to, to see what I need to donate, see what I have to donate, and see what I need to throw away. And I'm going to be doing that very soon. So, so stay tuned, guys. button also hit your notification bell so that you're notified every time I post a video and I will see you guys again on the next video thanks for joining me bye <laughs>